All right, so what I've got here, very neatly set up on a plant. Over here, I've got the tube from the pump. Of course, the probe is in over there. So what it's doing is, because it's below 50% over here, it wants to turn the pump on. So what it does is it passes it for two seconds and then dwells for 10 seconds to allow the soil to soak. So currently I've got the 5 volts for the pump on the power supply turned off. So let's turn that on. And what's going to happen is it's going to actually run the pump now when uh, it turns the pump on over there. So right, it is pumping. I'm going to give it a bit more voltage so there's a bit more flow. Got it up to 12 volts. There we go. So now we should see, should see this bar graph coming up. When it gets to 60%, it should stop pumping. So hopefully that... <laughs> happens sometime in the next uh, little while or I'm going to be editing this video but that's okay not a problem so there we go I can see the water dropping so that value should start coming up so you don't want to pump continuously because then you could overdo the watering um, before the water gets to the soil moisture probe and then you overwater the plant. So it's adding. Okay, so there it has reached the necessary level for the plant to be nicely watered. So it's just sitting there like that. And if it were to go down below 50% again, it's going to start pumping again. So there we can see the water level. And our automatic plant watering system is working. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for joining me here for my nice elegant display and set up of our little plant watering system. That capacitor probe works beautifully. Right, hope you enjoyed it. Hope you learned something, enjoyed it. Thanks for being here. Take care, have an awesome day further. I'll see you next time for more awesome stuff. Alrighty, bye.